Hello, this is Evan Smith with Copy Controls, and today I'm here to talk about how to install the correct drivers for your serial to USB RJ11 device. So, on most Windows installations, uh, you won't need to really reference this too much because they're part of uh, the standard operating system installation. Uh, but say for some reason you're having trouble with your device drivers. Uh, you, know, you might be using Linux or you might be using some non-standard version of Windows, what have you. Uh, so the solution there is we're going to actually go to prolific websites. They have the drivers right there. So we're just going to it's a quick Google search away. So prolific serial driver installer. And see, it's going to be this first uh, link here, right at the top of the page. So we're going to click. And then this zip file is the one that you're going to want. So we're going to click that, download it. As you might notice, I already have it uh, downloaded. So we're just going to uh, skip ahead to the actual files. Uh, and this is what it looks like when it's unzipped. So the next step is now to run this uh, application, the logo driver setup. And it'll bring you to the install shield wizard. Not too much you're going to have to do. Uh, if you're doing this for the first time, you might need to restart your computer to have it work. Uh, but we should be pretty much all set. And now we're just going to check device manager. And yeah, uh, you, as you can see, the proper uh, drivers have been installed for this and it recognizes it as a COM number. So uh, we should be all set to go. Now, let me do, I'm going to do just some CME, just to test this serial uh, communications. And yeah, look at that, it recognizes the COM number. And there we go. As you can see, I can talk to the drive. Uh, it's giving me feedback uh, on position, velocity, and current. Enable that to jog. Give it a little wake and wiggle. And yeah, all right. And that's how to set up your proper uh, serial to USB RJ11 drivers.